Hey guys, this is Budget Tech Dad, and welcome to another video on Chichichichia. And today we're gonna go over the thread and RAM impact on your plotting speed. And if there's really a point on changing the default settings for your plotting, and also are you really optimizing your resources well? Obviously, this is a joke here, like you'll never dedicate this much resources to one plot. First, I started with testing the threads. Um, if you saw my other video on CPU testing, this is pretty much the same result. The times for all these results are for one single plot, not parallel. It's just easier for me to compare apples to apples. The two CPUs I did was Ryzen 7 2700 and the i9-9900K. The Ryzen is a weaker processor than the 9900K. The diminishing returns really starting to see from like thread four over here. And for the 9900K, it's it's starting to go around like I would say five threads here. But when do you really use uh, more threads? There's two obvious situations and one of them is let's say you are limited on the amount of space on your plotting SSD. Let's say you have one terabyte and you could really only do three or four plots in parallel. You could definitely dedicate more threads to make it go faster. The other one is if you're staggering your plots, you can dedicate more threads to your staggered plot so that phase one complete faster because phase one is multi-thread. And next we're going to talk about RAM. First I started testing the Ryzen on two threads. I increased RAM here 1000 MIB at a time, but really I don't see a whole lot of impact here. Uh, a lot of the times here are just within margin of error, but on the Chia website, it did say four threads, you might see a little more impact. So I did four threads again and really didn't see any results here either. Same thing within the margin of error. So is there really a point of adding more RAM? Um, so I did a second test on the 9900K, just on four threads. You can see a little bit more results here. The impact time is really not that noticeable if you look at it. And you compare this 3390 here versus the 7390, it's just within like 15 minutes. But what's interesting is though, this someone on Reddit made this resource uses chart. And you can see that increasing memory does impact phase one and phase three and on his resource chart that's when most of the memory are being used so phase one and phase three here so it does match up with what the system is doing but to me there's nothing really interesting about this test either so what i did was why don't we do a reverse of this by going lower on the threads and ram so what's interesting here is this is the default uh, settings here the time for the default settings and then when I lower the thread, obviously impacts phase one because that's multi-thread. And if I lower the RAM, and that impacts phase three, which is when they rewrite the temp files to a smaller temp file. And phase two and phase four is not impacted at all. But what's interesting is that if I lower RAM to 2000, the time here is not a huge difference, especially if you look at the 9900K here, it's only off by 0.1 so you could really get away with a lot less RAM so depending on the processor you might not need to go out and get more RAM to do more parallel plots you might be able to get away with what you have already in the system and looking at the 9900k here if you use one thread you're really only extending the plot time by 30 minutes you know you could double up your your plots just by using one thread instead of two what I did also is I lowered the thread to one and the RAM to 1000, it, it still does work. Um, it just takes a lot longer here. You know, both of these take pretty long time to finish a plot. And I thought maybe, you know, the plot might not be good. So I did check it with the plus check command and they all came out pretty good quality out of 30 proofs. Mo the lowest I got was a 0.76 out of 30 proofs. So they do work. Quality doesn't really change. They're just very slow plots, right? So technically you still use something with very low threads and very low RAM and still plot something and still be a good plot. This is a chart that's on the Chia website. It says minimum here is 900 and that is the minimum. I tested it with the 800 and 800 failed at around 10%. So you can't go below this minimum. I did go below the medium and it's still like viable like that's still pretty good like right here is about 30 to 40 minutes apart 
but with this one it's literally six minutes here so it's very doable with less ram i hope this video helped you guys optimize your resources better happy plotting happy farming and i'll see you on the next one